G'day folks, if this drill seems to move a bit it's because it was sharpened by a draftsman. It is perfectly on centre in both directions. This clip is actually recorded after I'd got the drill on centre because it was far too low. Not sure if I've shown this before but I check this sort of thing with a piece of paper. There you can see the rub marks on the drill for it when it was not aligned properly. The spindle here should not be turning but that's the way my lathe was behaving at the time. Now you just push the rod into the hole and then check where the clearance is. It'll be cut where it's too tight and not cut where it's too loose. When I was an apprentice this is the way we used to check the clearance between a punch and die. So with my brain on holiday I used some shims to pack the drill up to get the centre height correct. I made a number of attempts as you can see here using different shims under the bottom of the tool holder to lift it up. Eventually I got it even all round and I was quite happy with it. However the drill was still rubbing and this is why. That's all I'd managed to achieve. I later used it on a boring bar but it was useless for the drill. For the drill I actually had to make a new holder to put it in the right place. If copy paper proves to be too thick, you can always use a cigarette paper. Hope this is useful for someone. Thank you for watching.